What's up everyone? Tonight I wanted to talk for a few minutes about the debate between using New Line and Standard End Line in C++. So I've been reading a lot about it and it bothers me that you keep hearing how New Line is faster but you don't really see a lot behind that. The main reason that we're always given is because it doesn't flush. So when you use standard end line behind the scenes, it's a lot like using a new line and then flushing it so that it immediately goes to the output buffer. So I wanted to dig into that a little bit. So what we want to talk about is ignore the caps alright so what does this mean it means when we are writing a program the recommended thing to do is when you write something to the screen just do sorry something like that instead of what you may have historically done using standard end line which would have been more like that so let's dig into this a little bit when we take a look at Google what actually comes right up it comes up that end line causes a flushing of the output buffer every time it's called. Because of that, as they say, using hmm, <clears throat> I have to stop for a minute. So it says the difference is obvious. The second one is much faster. So this is saying end line is much faster. Standard end line always flush flushes the stream. In turn, new line simply puts a new line character to the stream and in most cases this is exactly what we need. So articles a little old. I think they meant to say that new line is much faster. Let's scroll down a little bit more. We see if you do use endline, endline is actually slower because it forces a flush which actually unnecessary. What else do we got? Interesting, that must have been where that first statement well above was taken from. All right, write a new line character and flush the stream. The difference lies in the fact that standard endline has a call which makes it slower. And writing a standard endline to a stream is exactly equivalent to writing a new line followed by a standard flush. And here, interesting enough, the endline function, part of the C standard function library, inserts a the program using new line runs 45 seconds faster. So a lot out there that would make you think you should not use standard end line. And I was working on a project. I started going through and replacing a lot of my usage of standard end line with just the new line. And I don't think there's anything wrong with doing that, but I want to know why. Is that really the case? Is it really that much faster to use the new line character? So I wrote a quick sample program to test that out. So what we have here is a quick program in Windows where we're going to use a simple f call to the chrono library to just take timestamps. We're going to check if a number is numeric just for our input checking because it's going to be a command line program that accept, accepts a parameter, which is just how many times to print something to the screen. 
then the actual main function here where we're just checking the command line arguments um, getting the number of iterations to run right here is where we are going to run it using the new line character and right here is where we're going to do the exact same thing running the standard end line so we're going to run them both one after the other and then when we're done it is going to print out the results using the new line and then print out the results again using the end line and we'll see how it goes so let us try it out and see what happens now I've already compiled it but just to see what I'm using I'm using GCC and when we run it we are going to ah shit there we go ignore the screw ups now let's test it 100,000 times that seems like a good number if after running these 100,000 times it's still very similar I will argue that it's more important well it's usually more important anyway as long as it's not a major performance penalty where you definitely want to argue your case but typically if wherever you're at there's a certain coding standard you should stick to that coding standard that said let's give it a try we're gonna see a lot of writing to the screen alright alright We're almost there. All right, let's have a look. You can kind of see the results already. All right, I must have cleared the screen. Damn me. Okay. So you'll note that the end line ultimately took. 80 milliseconds longer over a hundred thousand runs so I would call that negligible possibly even a tie and run it again see if we get the same results all right when we look at it this time again it looks like it's about 77 milliseconds difference all right one more time all right uh, that's our furthest yet it's uh, what 90 90 milliseconds so I actually ran it once back when I was testing and even had endline come back quicker so it's it's very close very close hey everyone all right so this is day two I wasn't expecting to do a day two but I woke up this morning thinking a lot about this issue and wanted to try something else so let's jump into it what was I thinking I was thinking I wonder if the issue isn't necessarily end line versus new line it's the fact that we're I'll say concatenating them putting them into the string or into what gets written out maybe that's what's actually taking the time and if that's the case I would say I think it's 
a misnomer that the issue is definitely with endline itself the issue is more with the fact that you're adding more concatenation onto the string or onto the output so let's give it a shot and see what happens so we're going to just stop noting the iteration on here all right so this is what it would normally look like if you're not putting in any variables or anything else into your output so let's see what happens when we do this so we're gonna create a new I already tested this out so I kinda know the answer already but let's make a new executable and try it for our hundred thousand I think I just did a million. So let's take one off. And see what happens. There we go. Okay, so when we look at this, we definitely start to see a difference of not quite 33%, but still a much more significant difference. So I would argue that the issue isn't in using standard headline itself the issue is more in the fact that you are pushing it into the output separately from the string versus with the new line where it's just part of the string that's getting sent to the output so let me know your thoughts and thank you for thank you for watching i hope you have a good day